Appalachian Wireless has some of the best data rates in wireless on our plans, and not to mention an amazing deal on one of our hottest smartphones. But that's all the time I have to explain. See store for details. Better service, bigger savings. That's today's Appalachian Wireless. It's no secret that many around the country believe that the coal industry is on its last leg. But students around the region in eastern Kentucky are putting forward their ideas this week for a brighter future for coal at the annual Cedar Regional Coal Fair. Cedar was started in 1994 as a uh, partnership between uh, the coal industry, the business community, and, and the uh, academia world. And said so we want to come up with a program that can help improve the image of the coal industry through educating our, the public. And the consensus was, well, you know, you need to educate your students. You know, that's your youth. That's really where it starts. Justice says that when the program began, many of the projects focused on the history of coal. But as the industry has developed more and more hardships, the focus has turned to the future of coal. As the industry has changed, we saw that in order to stay relevant, Cedar was going to have to make a pivot because what we'd done for 23 years was no longer going to remain relevant with the changing times within the industry. So the Cedar Board of Directors last August expanded, did not do away with our original mission statement, but it expanded it to include for teachers to uh, and their, their students to investigate and research the causes of what caused the industry to decline. Any, uh, any uh, solutions to those problems that might be able to allow the industry to come back or for them to come up with a new use of coal. The divisional winners and the overall grand prize winner will all be announced at the awards banquet on Saturday. Reporting from Pikeville for EKB News, I'm Jackson Latta.